Hi, good evening to you and welcome to today's Insta Live and in this live you and I are going to learn a lot. I have Insta Lives on various topics that have to do with wellness and beauty. In fact, it is choosing wellness to look and feel beautiful because beauty, the right approach to beauty is awesomeness inside out. So we work on making our cells really healthy and we make these cells really healthy by the right nutrition, by hormonal balances, by right lifestyle changes, by keeping our emotional and social health healthy. And when we are healthy at all levels, automatically our cells are healthy and cell, healthy cells equal to beautiful cells. So do you agree to this and do you resonate with this that rather than trying to make a strand of hair look beautiful or your skin look beautiful, how much nicer it could be if you shift the focus to the roots instead of just depending on the fruits, instead of working on the fruits, would you like to shift your focus to the roots and ensure that your roots are healthy and hence your fruits are nutritious luscious beautiful so the new approach is awesome inside out and that is what i stand for work on yourself at a cellular level by making healthy choices rather take responsibility of working on yourself at a cellular level and that will translate into amazing skin hair and body shape at any age and when you have amazing skin, hair and body shape at any age, that's an important aspect of your personality and that will help you have an amazing personality. So let us dive into the topic of today which is PRP. So thank you for joining Uday. and do you know what is PRP? Have you heard of this term PRP? So PRP is also known as platelet rich plasma. It is one of the globally proven medical technologies that is trending quite a lot. It's very very popular and it is used for regrowth. It is used for extremely good rejuvenation of cells. It can be used in the internal organs also. It can be used even when there is a disease in the body. Whenever there is an organ not doing well, also PRP is used. PRP is used in dermatology for amazing skin and amazing hair. PRP gives you a lot of growth factors. It gives you growth of healthy new cells and you can have younger looking skin and younger looking hair. So you must be wondering what is this obsession with younger? Younger is healthier. Younger is having more nutrition, having the cellular structure more healthy. So that is what a PRP can do to you. So today we are going to be talking about the PRP treatment in hair. The PRP treatment in hair can give you three advantages and these three advantages you can get whether you are male or you are female you can get reduction in hair loss. So those of you who are really struggling with hair loss and you are looking for a solution but you do not want too many steps also you do not want to visit the doctor too many times you are looking for something that is proven and that can give you results in hair loss in a simple way with minimum steps and that has been proven to give great results in many people PRP could be the solution for you yes prp is something that could be a little more expensive than a regular treatment so i would want you to know the pros and the cons of course there aren't really any great side effects but yes i will also be sharing with you what could be the side effects of prp who should go for prp and who prp may not be for so before that let me just share with you a little about me my name is dr shweta Anger and i am the founder of skin sense aesthetic clinic and i am passionate about educating you about the best practices the best practices that are globally proven and thousands of people have benefited from and i am going to not just share these best practices with you just as a theory but i am going to help you translate them into action steps which is after every conversation with me you will be empowered to take some kind of action or not take some kind of action you will have clarity of what you want to choose or what you do not want to choose and with this understanding you will be able to make smarter choices you will be able to make more effective choices you will be able to make more value for money choices 
you will be able to make choices that resonate with you so today's topic is prp which is among the gold standard therapies for hair regrowth so when we talk about hair we talk about things which are an everyday we did speak about oils we did speak about serums next week no not next week in fact the next insta live which is on thursday we will be talking about rice water therapy yes i have spoken about rice water therapy before i have two videos about rice water therapy on my youtube channel if you are in a hurry to know what this rice water therapy is i suggest you can go and check that out the rice water therapy helps you with reduction in dandruff rice water therapy helps you in reduction in hair fall it cuts down the frizz of your hair it also helps in condition like scalp seborrhea and so much more it is simple to do it doesn't cost you a lot of money yes it's a home remedy so i am a skin doctor i am a hair doctor i talk less about home remedies but i have seen so many people get such incredible results with the rice water therapy that finally i said that my mission is to empower you my mission is to solve your problem so in whichever way i know that it will work for you whichever scientific way i know that it will work for you i am willing to give it to you so all i share is not just what i have learned in the textbooks a lot of things which i have learned in my journey of 11 years working with men and women struggling with all kind of skin and hair issues and i have given them incredible solution in their skin and hair of course it's not been easy it's been a learning process for 11 years because every body is different everybody desires different everybody's budget is different so over 11 years i have understood how i can choose a person and give them something that they will simply love having and i am going to share all those learnings with you so rice water therapy is for some people who want only home remedies to take care of their hair and prp is for those people who are looking at world class treatments who are looking at great transformation in their hair they do not have much time they do not want to do anything at home but they want to know what is the best available today which can help them stop hair fall grow new hair and improve the texture of the hair so is that you i would like you to type yes in the comments if you want to know more about prp if you have any questions about prp you can write them in the comments if the question is going to be answered as i continue the conversation i will not answer the question in between this conversation is going to continue for 20 more minutes and i promise you all your questions will be answered in these 20 minutes yes if certain more questions come to your mind i have a youtube channel my clinic name is skin sense my name is dr shweta ayangar you can subscribe to my youtube channel my youtube channel has most videos of just 5 minutes and all my videos talk about action steps that you can take and these action steps are going to help you take some powerful action not take actions that may or may not work because everything i share i take personal responsibility of it done right those action steps will work for you because i am sharing only action steps that have worked for thousands of men and women and transformed their life so i get your question are prp results for life long no no results are for life long because the body is dynamic so if we are talking about hair aging if we are talking about genetic hair thinning and we are boosting the scalp with uh, a lot of growth factors a lot of nutrients yes you will get transformational results this is like saying if somebody goes to the gym or somebody decides to go for a superb yoga program and they get incredible flexibility yes even a very stiff person under the right guidance can get incredible flexibility but will that flexibility last for life it will only if the person goes for a maintenance regime so as the body is continuously evolving the cells are shedding the body is replacing itself the hair is replacing itself every cell is replacing itself no therapy will work for life long therapies will require maintenance so here we are talking about having an approach to wellness being proactive being ambitious and being ready to take action steps which will boost our wellness but if you are over the age of 35 which means the natural process of aging has started in the body and you need 
some kind of extra investment with the kind of stress we live in with the kind of food we eat we need some kind of extra investment to keep the results that we get so the prp sessions you may be recommended four or six sessions in fact i've seen people get incredible results with just four sessions and then the maintenance can be as less as one session in a year or if you are extremely aspirational or you have very very severe genetic predisposition it could be two sessions in a year so that gets as easy as that so if somebody is offering you one or two sessions as a maintenance after completion of four sessions and this ensures that your hair roots your hair cells are fed with the proper nutrition and you have minimal hair troubles you have control in hair loss you have healthy regrowth of hair and your hair texture also is reasonably good it doesn't get unnecessarily frizzy brittle unkept i think it is worth it if you think that you want to invest in your personality and you have the money to invest in the personality when we are talking about prp we are talking of something that is referred to as a gold standard we talking about something that the celebrities are using which is globally proven and prp is an expensive treatment so thank you everybody who is here and asking me questions in fact your questions are more than welcome you can also write to me on pm and let me know your questions because it is your questions which inspire me to show up twice in a week and to add value to you because my gratification here is knowing that somebody is empowered with a new learning and somebody can make better choices so thank you for your question i am beginning with a series of simplified questions and answers that will explain to you everything about prp so what is prp prp is known as platelet rich plasma so when we take the blood the blood has a plasma and the blood has platelets in it so the platelets are removed the red blood cells and the white blood cells are removed out it is these platelets in the plasma that we need so we need we have red blood cells we have white blood cells and we have platelets and these are in a liquid called as a plasma what we are interested in is the activated platelets these activated platelets are high on growth factors the plasma is high in protein so this protein rich growth factor rich concentrate is taken from your own body so now let me tell you something very simple that you will totally resonate with so if i scratch my hand there are cells which are going to come and they are going to heal the wound so whenever we get hurt whenever we get scratched we also heal why do we heal because there are healing powers in the body there are cells which are capable of causing the body to heal there are some kind of stem cells and growth factors in the body that ensure that every time we hurt we heal so using the same power of the stem cells and the growth factors we concentrate these stem cells and growth factors because these stem cells and growth factors are capable of causing very very high quality healing very very fast healing and they are able to if you concentrate them on an area they will be very good healing in that area so if somebody is having a hair fall if somebody is having a hair thinning which means that in their scalp there are less number of growth factors yes if we are talking to somebody who's totally bald then a prp is not going to help because what does a prp do a prp boosts the growth of the healthy cell so number 1 is the cell that we want to grow needs to be alive so you need to take cognizance of this of course if you go to a doctor and want to take a prp a doctor will definitely tell you this if you have lost too much of hair if you are not at the stage of hair thinning if you are at the stage of hair baldness then a prp will not be able to help you because as i say medicine has done a lot of marvelous things there is magic happening in medicine but still dead cannot be made alive so the first thing you need to know is you need to have active hair follicles for prp to do its magic now let me tell you how the process of prp happens we understood the logic behind the prp using the potential of the body using the healing potential of the body to concentrate all the growth factors in an area where you are looking at great healing great growth and using 
the power of those growth factors causing a lot of rejuvenation a lot of growth in that area prp is also used on the face a lot of people have got rid of wrinkles pigmentation scars so anywhere where the skin is not is not properly healed where the skin is not very healthy using a prp solution could create miracles but today we are not talking about the skin we will have another discussion where we talk about the skin rather than over complicating by talking about too many things we will keep it simple and focused so we keep it simplified to prp and we answer all the questions about prp so blood is removed from your body so a doctor will remove 20 ml of blood from your body this blood which is a red colored blood will contain rbc's wbc's plasma and platelets but what we need is the plasma and the platelets so this blood will first be stabilized so stabilization of this blood is a very very important step and that is another place where medicine has done a lot of research and today so many wonderful reagents are available which can help you stabilize this blood because you do realize that if we cut and the blood flows out of the body the blood is going to clot and once the blood clots then most of the growth factors of the blood are destroyed and that blood is useless so the most important part of the prp is removing the right quantity of blood and this right quantity of blood has to very very responsibly be mixed with a reagent a very very specialized reagent which stabilizes the blood even when it is out of the body which does not allow the blood to clot now this mixture of blood and an anticoagulant solution with a lot of powerful ingredients added to it is now put into a centrifuge machine so a centrifuge machine moves the blood at a particular speed all this is extremely technical and has to be done according to the protocol for the best results you will get a separation of the rbc's and the wbc's because the rbc's and the wbc's are not something we require for our prp treatment we just need the platelets and the plasma so there will be a separation of the platelets and the plasma and this is what we are going to use to put it into the scalp and as we introduce the platelet and the plasma into the scalp there is an abundance of growth factors in the scalp and this leads to reduction of inflammation in the scalp this leads to making the hair healthy at the follicular level this leads to boosting the hair follicles with growth factors and ensuring that even the vellus hair or the hair which has become so weak that it is about to die starts growing and starts showing results in the form of hair regrowth hair fall almost immediately stops in 2 to 3 days after prp in most of the people of course we are talking about medicine and i have often said that medicine is not mathematics so results do vary from person to person but what i am sharing with you is what is commonly seen in most of the people hair fall instantly stops new regrowth starts and the quality of hair is much better so who would like to know more about prp and who has questions on prp please shoot your questions i am waiting to answer them for you so from the 20 ml of blood that we have extracted from the body around 5 ml of the solution is collected and this 5 ml of the solution is a very very thin liquid which is almost transparent it looks like water because the cells are removed and this is only the platelet and the growth factors now immediately the process cannot be stored the process as soon as the centrifuge happens we take small needles which are also known as insulin syringes with needles which we use to put insulin in the body so casually they are known as insulin syringes what they do is they have the potential to just go slightly under the skin so this is known as a subcutaneous drug delivery cutaneous meaning skin so where we want to go we want to go just under the skin we do not want to go in a muscle like a regular injection we do not want to go into the vein like a regular injection we want to deposit this abundance of growth factors not on the scalp because your roots are not on the scalp your roots are just below the scalp at the subcutaneous level also known as a mesoderm so what we do is we make sure that not just we collect these growth factors we take responsibility of putting the growth factors into the scalp 
in the area where the hair follicles lie so that the hair follicles are now surrounded by an abundance of growth factors and in this abundance of nutrition they, they grow magically well and men and women see never before results in their hair fall control in new growth in fact just in one session of prp the new growth definitely starts and the quality of hair is not wiry frizzy uncontrolled but there is a very good quality of hair so how is how do we inject this we inject this using an insulin syringe and this 5 ml of solution is injected all over the crown area the crown area is an area where you wear a crown or you wear a cap so that is a very very important area of the scalp so you inject this into the crown area in very very small small modules and around 80 injections may be given sometime but do not worry these 80 injections are not very painful it is absolutely bearable yes there is a pricking sensation but we are talking about a very small needle it's extremely thin it's extremely small and the amount of fluid deposited with every injection is very very small so you get a ant bite sensation or an acupuncture like sensation it is very very comf it's i won't call it comfortable i might call it irritating but it is not at all difficult to bear we do prp sessions for men and women at our clinic almost every day and everybody bears it yes it takes around 20 minutes to finish the procedure of injection the entire procedure of prp from collecting the blood waiting for it to centrifuge and everything together may even take up to 90 minutes but the injection procedure takes around 20 minutes and yes it can be an irritating procedure but it's absolutely non-messy and immediately after the injection the person can probably rest for 10 minutes and then go resume their normal activity there is no oiling there is no shampooing there is no kind of messiness involved because i think today a lot of my clients are looking for solutions which do not eat into their work day they are very very committed to their work and taking a holiday from their work for these procedures sometimes becomes very very inconvenient for them so prp is a procedure for somebody who says i don't have time i don't like mess i do not want too many steps but i want incredible results because here we are not using simple things and multiple layers of things and trying to create something it is like when i explain to my patients i generally tell them it is like a blood transfusion so if somebody is feeling weak rather than giving them fruit juices tablets even glucose ka pani and even by rather than giving them a saline there is one option that exists which is directly giving them blood so if somebody is low hemoglobin and you are going to give them a bottle of blood that is a definite way to increase your hemoglobin similarly rather than just giving some vitamin tablets for hair fall rather than giving serums for hair fall rather than giving certain kind of massages for hair fall if you directly take the stem cells from the body directly take the platelet rich plasma from the body which is abundant in growth factors not just that if you inject it in an area where it is exactly needed you you complete the whole cycle and the results most of the time are incredible so who is it for it is for absolutely anybody who is aspirational anybody who is looking at hair maintenance there are people who don't even have hair loss but then they come from a celebrity family they are people who have a lot of socializing to do and they are aging yes we all age and as we age our skin hair body everything undergoes changes so we have people who come and start a prp session so that their aging is slowed down and despite their aging their hair doesn't deteriorate week after week month after month year after year so if you want to just maintain yourself you have no problem at all you have beautiful hair but you are somebody who wants to take responsibility for looking younger than your age for slowing down your aging you can take one or two prp sessions in a year it will be very very good for you because as you age definitely the growth factors in the body become less the circulation becomes less the fall is a lot more than before and naturally the regrowth becomes slower so if we can use these smart techniques to amplify the regrowth or the rejuvenation you will definitely look years younger than your age when it comes to hair so this is one place where prp is used otherwise 
in women with diffuse hair fall where they have a lot of hair fall so there are many ways of correcting hair fall and all of them are valid all of them are good but somebody who's looking at a very very quick results and somebody whose body doesn't absorb nutrition so sometimes you know despite giving all the right nutrition the digestion the assimilation the absorption is compromised so nutrition causes a lot of acidity people are not able to eat many things and they are not getting results from the nutrition just going for that session of PRP you can you can cut down on a lot of tablets you can cut down on a lot of application because the PRP will be able to achieve a lot in diffuse hair fall yes it is the treatment of choice for people who have PCOD it is the treatment of choice for people who have male or female pattern thinning because in PCOD and male and female pattern thinning I have mentioned this the problem is not just the hair fall the problem is that the regrowth of hair is compromised and if the regrowth of hair is compromised if you do not do the right thing at the right time people start showing thinning and this thinning progresses to balding so if you have somebody who is showing balding whose scalp is beginning to show they are feeling embarrassment because their scalp is beginning to show whether they are male or female so what matters to them is not just stopping the hair fall but growing new hair and PRP is the treatment of choice for them too who should not go for PRP if you have an active scalp infection if you have psoriasis or seborrheic dermatitis of the scalp you must first treat the active scalp infection we do not want to inject when there is an active scalp infection we want to first ensure that this active scalp infection is taken care of under the guidance of a doctor and then we can administer the PRP another case is if you are too late if you have so much thinning that most of your hair is lost and you know for a fact that you have been too late in reaching out to a doctor and probably now transplant is your only solution then PRP may not work because if you go back to the conversation and understand you need to have a lot of active follicles so that you can boost them with this growth factor so this is like giving very high quality fertilizers but then you need to have the seeds intact so if a person has already got a high level of baldness like we say grade 3 or grade 4 level of baldness then PRP is not the uh, treatment of choice for them of course PRP rates vary differently from clinic to clinic and PRP results also vary differently from clinic to clinic so here I would like to throw some light on why the rates vary from clinic to clinic so very important part of the PRP is the stabilizing agent and the stabilizing agent because it is very difficult to preserve the blood outside the body the stabilizing agent is quite expensive so clinics which use a very high quality a very high grade of a stabilizing agent will charge you premium for their PRP and I think I would pay premium for the PRP if I get my PRP done I would definitely want to look at the stabilizing solution being used and which company it is coming from the better the quality of the stabilizing solution the better the yield of the stem cells you're going to get in the PRP and the better the yield of the stem cells that you get in the PRP the better that the results you get in the PRP so whenever you are talking to any clinic about the PRP do not just compare and do not just make decision based on the price that do not think while one clinic is giving a cheaper PRP and one clinic is giving a more expensive PRP I would want you to look at the results that the clinic is delivering the credibility that the clinic has the kind of products that they're using you could even ask them to show you the stabilizer that they're using sometimes some people use really good and expensive stabilizers like we use one of the best quality stabilizers which comes expensive to us so our PRP sessions are not very cheap but they are very effective as compared and contrasted with some people who use stabilizers which are not of a great quality and that will definitely compromise on the results so whenever you take any kind of decision do not take label to label and cost to cost also compare what are the breakups why are they charging so much what is the difference between the two clinics methodology of doing PRPs and most important the results speak for themselves so before I sign off I think we've had a lovely conversation and we have already exceeded our time by two three minutes so I would like to tell you that typically minimum PRP sessions you need is two maximum PRP sessions you need is six the optimum PRP sessions you need is four 
and up these sessions can be taken once in six weeks it's more than sufficient yes it takes around 90 minutes end to end because you have to collect the blood and you have to wait for the blood to be sent to you but then the session takes only 20 minutes and yes it will require maintenance sessions and these maintenance sessions can be as less as once in a year so it gets as simple as that so prp is definitely a recommend for those who love beautiful hair those who want to invest that bit into the hair but do not want to spend too much of time and do not want those messy regimes that you know apply this hot towel your hair do this do that so if that is not the kind of treatment that you are comfortable with you must ask me about prp send me your questions subscribe to my youtube channel it is called skin sense my name is dr shweta Anger. you know that my website is www.skinsense.co.in you can write me your questions on my mail because I personally answer my mail through my website. Also, you can ask me my questions on my Instagram direct messenger. By now, you know, I'm passionate about giving you the right curated information and giving you facts that really work. And I am delighted to answer your questions always. So thank you so much for being here and supporting me. Our Insta lives happen on Tuesday and Thursday at 9. And it's always about topics around wellness and beauty. And we are talking about action steps. We are empowering you with facts and myths so that you can take the right decision so that you get incredible results without wasting too much time and many money and you choose the solution that resonates with you. So what is going to happen on Thursday? So there is something for the hair called as rice water therapy. It's globally very, very popular where water from the washed rice is stored and used in a particular way and this has helped people get better texture of hair, stop their hair fall, control their dandruff and multiple different benefits. I have spoken about it twice in the past and every time got very very good feedback. In fact people often write to me after watching my videos that we tried what you said and it is amazing we have loved it. So I thought I should do a rice water therapy live once again because a few of you who watch it and try it are going to write to me and are going to say thank you for sharing this with me. I love feedback. Keep, keep connected with me. Your questions are welcome. Your feedback is welcome. Looking forward to see you at 9 on Thursday right here on Instagram Live. I love Skin Sense. Good night.